everyone, it's Laura from OurEarlyHouse.com and today I'm going to share with you guys a exfoliating peppermint foot scrub. Exfoliating your skin is actually a really important thing to do as I was writing up this blog post and doing some research on it. Our skin as we age doesn't shed dead skin, I know that's gross, as fast as it does when you're younger. And so giving it a little help by exfoliating it is a very good thing to do for your skincare. Now you should strive to do it about two to three times a week. If you have oily skin, you might need to do this more often. I am going to share with you a foot scrub that I have found to work really well on dry, cracked heels and just really dry skin on the bottoms of your feet. There are several natural exfoliators that you can use. You probably know about sugar and salt, but you can also use coffee beans. You can use rice and rice water has some really good benefits for your skin. You can use baking soda. I talked all about these different exfoliators and some different benefits of each over on the blog at OurEarlyHouse.com. You can search foot scrub. But today for this one, I am using salt. And the reason why I'm using salt is because it is is more coarse than most of the other options and when you're talking about the bottoms of your feet I kind of think the more coarse the better because that's where you're gonna find a lot of that really dry cracked skin and this is going to work better so a sugar scrub is going to be better for hands and maybe your face and salt's gonna be a little bit better for your feet this is a super simple recipe and I'm just going to make it straight into the little mason jar here that I'm gonna store it in and I'm going to do a half a cup in of pink Himalayan salt. Now using a sea salt is best because sea salts have a lot of added minerals and vitamins and things that are really, really good for the skin. So this is gonna add more benefits for you. And then you're gonna do a quarter of a cup of a carrier oil and I'm using coconut oil because that's just what I have on hand and again coconut oil has some good benefits for the skin but if you have olive oil in your pantry whatever oil you have that's a vegetable base is going to work just fine in here now i'm going to add in about 20 drops of peppermint essential oil and i am using peppermint because i love that minty fresh smell and i think it's just the best one for a foot rub because it has some cooling and soothing properties to it so it's good for achy feet or any type of discomfort. So this one, massage into your feet, is going to be really helpful just with that peppermint oil in there. So I'm adding in peppermint, and then I'm just going to stir this all up, get everything well combined together, and you are gonna have a nice exfoliating foot scrub. Super easy, and I bet you have all these ingredients just sitting in your pantry, so you can whip this up really quickly. Sorry about my children, they're supposed to be napping and they're not. So my baby always naps and my older three are all starting to outgrow naps so it's more like a quiet time and yeah, not so quiet. So anyway, <laughs> my favorite way to use this foot scrub is to actually get a little container with some warm water in it Put a tablespoon into the warm water, soak my feet for about 10-15 minutes, and then actually put a tablespoon or so on my foot and onto my leg and just massage it in. I find that once my feet are soaked in the water, it makes it easier to exfoliate the skin. So that's my favorite way to use it. You can just put it straight on your feet and massage it in, but soaking them first is definitely going to help to exfoliate them a little bit better. If you guys like this recipe, be sure to check out some other videos that I think you'll love down in my description below. I also have a label for your exfoliating peppermint foot scrub over on the blog. I have a link for that in the description below as well. And if this is your first time by my channel, I'd love it if you hit that subscribe button. I get out new videos every week on essential oil education, natural remedies, and healthy recipes. Thank you so much for stopping by our oily house.